so today is day 25 um, I've been on the snow fap streak for 25 days now that means no porn no masturbation none of that stuff and uh, I would have to say this third week has been the most challenging now day four was one of my biggest hurdles and the urges were hard to resist I got through that and now this third week has been rough too. I, in my last video I talked about um, flatline and basically I just vented all of my frustrations, my personal frustrations and I realized I wasn't very positive, I didn't have a lot of um, you know motivational things to say and that's just where I was at. Um, and, and things are still rough. It's actually been a very rough um, day. Had some. I actually had some urges that were pretty strong, and um, but I did survive the day, and I made it through the weekend without relapsing. And that might be a surprise to some of you guys, because some of you guys are talking about thinking that I'm gonna relapse, but I didn't. Okay, but I do want to say thank you guys for um, commenting on my last video and being very encouraging. 24/7 Betterment, Andrew Ratterman, uh, Midnight uh, 3OD. Um, ninth Spirit, Day 16, hopefully you're still going, Matt Nofap, Limitless JC, and Jed Tennessee. Thank all of you guys um, for the encouragement and motivation. I didn't want to make a video today, but I realized that I need to stay um, current in my new habits that I've been creating in this last 20-something um, days, 25 days. So, and I worked out today, even though I felt no motivation, I sat there and got on the ground and did my freaking push-ups, did my sit-ups, did my reps of my workouts that I do, my body weight workouts. And honestly, I felt 10% better after that. I can't say I feel 100% better and I feel like um, just an amazing rush of dopamine hit my brain and I'm feeling great. No, I'm not feeling great. So I don't know if I'm having a flat line or not, but I know I've lost a certain amount of motivation on this, um, on this journey, on, on this nofap lifestyle, um, this streak that I'm on. I've lost um, a connection, like I, I've lost some kind of spark of energy, but you know, I have to keep on keep it on and I really appreciate um, what you guys you know I really appreciate this community I have to remember um, to be grateful the gratitude is so important to me and I spent some time today with that and I just I had to make a video and let you guys know my appreciation for this accountability because um, this is a real thing, you know, this is a, a good thing and it's um, every, I wish everyone could do this everyone that was out there struggling with pornography I mean this is it's, it's, it's just becoming um, it's a new phenomenon and it's, it's spreading and it's, it's getting it's getting huge pornography addiction but it's so unseen you know, no one knows about it because everyone keeps it hidden and you can't really just talk about it. It's kind of a taboo subject. No one talks about it. And it's, um, I was reading today. I was reading, that's, a, that's what I had to do today. I had to read. And I was reading um, Your Brain on Porn. And it talks about the sex drive is the most, um, what was it saying? Oh, hold on. It was saying, um, oh yeah, I was talking about the, um, the sexual desire is one of our most powerful motivation forces. Like, our most powerful motivational force is our sex drive. And then, when you get pornography, transforms that drive into a force that primarily motivates the completely solitary, solitary and unproductive activity of masturbation crazy good stuff in this book I recommend it to everyone um, 
Yeah. That's what's going on. Uh, I don't have much more to say. I do not, um, I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm doing it. I am staying alive. Day number 25. Bente Cinco. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Peace. Keep it real.